Hello and welcome to the video on how to make your Chromebook come back to life. Um, many Chromebooks these days, especially older ones, are becoming what is known as end of life, which means that they will no longer receive software updates. Um, this is a bit annoying and also a bit of a security risk, so one of the things we are going to do uh, in this series of videos is show you the whole process to convert a Chromebook from Chrome OS to a different version of Linux that allows the uh, system to function again and receive updates as appropriately. Now, there is a Chrome OS Flux out there now as of the day that we're doing this video, and it works pretty well, but it doesn't work on all Chromebooks. Uh, this particular Chromebook is kind of an older one. It was about 2014, 2015. Uh, it's reached its end of life. It is a Dell 3180, and it is what is known as a Baytrail processor. I'm sorry, a, a Braswell processor. Um, Baytrail and uh, Braswell are both processor types, but they are really older versions of Intel processors. Uh, the big problem with Chrome OS Flex and putting Chrome OS Flex on one of these is the difficulty of getting sound to work. Everything else seems to work fine with Chrome OS Flex, but these older systems, it, Chrome OS Flex just will not support any kind of sound. So we're gonna go through the process here. Uh, this is the first video in the series. I'm not quite sure how many videos I'm going to need, but this is the first one where we're just gonna be taking out the right protect screw. We have to do this in order to make sure that we have the ability to put in a new BIOS. Uh, the BIOS is just kind of the operating system on the chip itself. Anyway, here we go.